It's finally here. I just can't believe it's finally here. But it wouldn't be here without the people that worked on this film, gave their life and love and passion every second making this beautiful miracle of a film. This was the dream cast of all dream casts for me. Um, from top to bottom and uh, you know I always say and John and I always talk about this I always say the goal is for me never have to choose anybody they just claim the roles for themselves and that's what happened with every single person here so we're so excited to have you join us under the sea for this big extravaganza but mostly um, we're just so proud to be able to bring this to the world now. We feel it's important to bring to the world. And um, it's a classic, timeless, very profound piece. And we can't wait for you to enjoy it tonight. Thank you so much. I think there are many. I, I think that they got deep on the relationship of a father between a father and a daughter and how fear and insecurity of the father can create a blocking uh, situation for her beloved daughter to grow and real love is about letting your the person that you love be free and be her own or his own that's one thing but I think it's about listening to listen to listening to oneself in order to be loyal to what you want to become and also listening to others beyond Prejudgment beyond what other people are saying about that, those people. Like really seeing from yourself, hearing from yourself, and making a decision uh, based on what you wish and what you want. It was amazing to be there because I play this King Trident and, uh, and you have to play the king and you have to hold the trident. But also, what I was amazed, it was about the quality of everybody around. I mean, not only the actors, but the crew and the people working behind the camera and the quality of the, every detail. So I feel like 
blessed to be part of that as I feel blessed to be part of this today and be in a movie like such as this because I think the movie is gonna is gonna melt a lot of hearts <laughs> I think we've all been waiting for it for so long. It was such a labor of love. It was so fun to do, but we've been at it a long time. And I think just to finally get it to people and kind of share the joy is, it's everything we wanted it to be. And just to be here doing it and see everybody here, we're out, we're together. It's wonderful. I have to say, I'm pretty sweet on Ursula. I know she's the villain, but to me, she's, she's slightly misunderstood. And I think she's all the wonderful, complex, challenging things that most people are. There's good, bad, and lots of gray. I think I'm excited for them to realize what a love letter it is to the original and that how Rob Marshall has made it so relevant to a story for today. It is very much the story of two young people really carving out the life they want and two different worlds kind of being afraid of the unknown. And when we all get to know each other a little better, we're not so afraid of things. Yeah, it's super exciting, and I'm seeing it for the first time tonight, so I'm, I'm yeah, I can't wait. Um, yeah, there's so many little moments from the, the work process in my head, you know, and I'm, I am, like, tingling with excitement to see what they actually came out like. <laughs> uh, it was so much fun. Just this team really let us kind of stretch out, and we got to spend so much time together, so we really got to become like a like a cast and a company and play off of each other in a way that doing voice work you normally don't get to do, you know. So it's pretty special. Uh, yeah, it's it's it never happens like this. So. I'm really excited to watch this and hear everyone's reactions because when I saw this for the first time, my cheeks hurt from smiling. Like I was crying the whole shebang. So I'm excited to feel everyone else join me on that journey for sure. <laughs> I'm really happy and I'm really proud of it. I think it's fantastic and I can't wait to watch it again with everyone's like reaction in the audience. Honestly, just I'm really excited for them to see Hallie. I think she does such a fantastic job. Um, she, she plays Ariel so flawlessly. Um, I'm really excited for, for the world to see that. Yeah, dude, I mean, that's, that's the best part is like being able to celebrate it. This is crazy, we've completely taken over Hollywood Boulevard. Um, and it's just nice to be here with like the cast and, and, and be, be together all again. So yeah, I'm, I'm very excited to be here. Yeah, I mean, I think what I, I you know, like when we first came to London, almost year, years ago to, to, to when we first met, I remember not really understanding they hadn't really started filming yet, but I knew that Rob had a strong vision and I knew that I like trusted something in him that, that could really do it. And, and I think that in, in a huge way, he pulled that off. And um, I think that, uh, Hallie is, everyone is, is so good in this movie. Um, so I, I, yeah, hats off to him. Oh, I love Scott. I loved Scuttle. Scuttle was one of my favorites, dude. Yeah, ever. And yeah, this is a rare dream role for me, for sure. Yeah. Man, I'm excited for them to discover, first of all, uh, the, all the new music that was written uh, that I, I, I think are, are really good. Um, and then also, you know, I hope that they discover like the love and and the and and the kind of like the the passion for the story as 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 we all did when we grew up watching it. I hope that that it does that in in a different way. And um, you know, I, I have the, that still there, and I just appreciate all the hard work that everyone put in. Um, I th I think we you know like everything everything you do you do for now, and this is for the now. You know whatever. The, the joy and the beauty of the film that my children watched, uh, I hope that this is one that my grandson will watch and, and just go, wow, Grandpa, that was good. And to watch it here, in this theater, with three and a half thousand people, with Dolby Sound, I mean, wow. I mean, I cried when I first saw it. I cried when I read the script, let alone what I'm gonna do today. I'll be blabbing. I can tell you. I am beyond thrilled, beyond honored, beyond blessed to be here. It blows my mind that our little animated film from 37 years ago when I started working with the company has transitioned and that I'm standing on this blue carpet. I, it's very surreal, it really is. It just makes me think of Howard and our cast and how proud I am just to be part of this film and part of our story. And I'm so thrilled that Rob Marshall captured our beautiful animated film into this transition of this live action retelling. And Hallie and all of the cast 
absolutely perfect. They're absolutely perfect. I think to fall in love with Ariel again, you know, to, to just know what this character is and this telling gives us even more of her story. And um, I think to love Ariel the way I love Ariel. It's incredible. I feel like I've been waiting for this moment for so long. Um, I literally feel like a little girl, like the first time I ever watched The Little Mermaid, the original. So it just, it's giving me butterflies, give me bubbles inside. See, I'm excited. I loved working with Lynn for so many reasons. I, you know the backstory. I knew, I knew about Lynn when he was a little boy, and I go, this boy, Lynn Mar Miranda. And I go, oh, that, that little boy he was his love Little Mermaid so much and loved the arts so much and was so curious about everything. And then one day there was this grown-up called Lynn manuel Miranda with these shows in the Heights at Hamilton. I love him so much. He's so talented. We had such a great time working together. I'm so proud of the songs we wrote. They're a real marriage of our sensibilities and the styles. And so, yes, it couldn't be better. The heart, the heart. The heart from both sides, from all sides. Um, Rob has done an amazing job in just taking you on a, an emotional ride um, that pays off so beautifully. Uh, it's, I, I can say I'm proud of this, and I am. I'm proud of what I've done, but so many people made this happen. So many wonderfully talented people. The idea of having Hallie play Ariel in this film and just giving a different representation and telling to the story of Disney's The Little Mermaid, having girls who looked like me when I was little be able to see a mermaid that looks like them is just such a historic moment and so impactful for us as a brand. And I'm a true Disney girl and have been in love with Disney princesses for a very long time. So it's, it's really wonderful to be here as a part of the brand and the founder of the brand, but to also be here as a Disney child. I am honestly super excited about this opportunity for Hallie. I remember when my daughter used to watch Chloe and Hallie on YouTube singing songs and to see both of their careers just skyrocket and to see her in this way like I'm, I'm so excited to see her in this so so happy for her